Welcome back. Sister Jan joins us, and you have a new job. You're the coordinator of the new St. Mother Theodore Guerin Shrine out at St. Mary of the Woods. Tell us all about this, because this is a huge job for you. It is a huge job, and I love it. I am new at this, and yet I feel like I have been doing this most of my life. Mm -hmm. um, St. Mother Theodore is near and dear to all of our hearts at the Woods, mm -hmm. and I think she's in um, our DNA. She's so. in our bones. And she died about 155 years ago this month. Mm -hmm. And um, but she, f I feel like she's walking and breathing and talking in the streets of Terre Haute. Mm -hmm. And um, so the interim shrine is still where it has been for the last five years. But um, soon, within the year, I believe, a new shrine will be uh, constructed, erected in t um, on the grounds of the mother house. Mm -hmm. And once again, her, her bones and her body will be uh, moved to the new place. Mm -hmm. I think if you want to be a saint these days, you have to be willing to have your <laughs> body parts moved all over the place. Well, let's so. talk about the interim shrine. That's okay. inside the church, correct? It's inside the church. If you enter the Church of the Immaculate Conception, mm -hmm. it's, uh, you can't miss it. I mean, it is bigger than life. And the, her, the tomb, the casket is there, made from uh, a tree that had felled by a storm on our grounds, mm -hmm. a walnut tree, mm -hmm. and made by two of our wonderful carpenters that work with and for the Sisters of Providence, who adore Mother Theodore, um, and so took great care and, uh, and beauty in erecting this beautiful tomb casket. And um, it is there, people from all over the world, 60 countries, about 62 countries, have been represented to come and honor and revere and pray to her. Um, just this morning, I got an email from somebody in Argentina Ooh. who wishes to have a relic of Mother Theodore. So uh, this afternoon, that will be on my, my to-do my list. To -do list. Yeah. So uh, it will be there at least through October, November, okay. December. So come, come and... and uh, Anybody's welcome. Anybody and everybody. Uh, Mother Theodore uh, is well-loved and well-known um, in, this, in this valley and in this country. And it, Indiana was dear to her heart. Mm -hmm. And she's our first saint. She is our state. first saint. And you might be the second. So you Oh, I don't think so. I don't <laughs> think so. <laughs> I can't reach that level. Well, Mother Theodore says it, you don't have to do anything ordinary. or You don't have to do anything extraordinary. Okay. Just ordinary, but it's how you do it. It's how you do it. How you do it. And quickly, we're running out of time, but there's a yes. big festival coming up in yes. October. October 21st, 22nd, 23rd. Mm -hmm. Everyone's welcome. And again, it's a time to enjoy her life, to spread her energy and her value system. So um, it's a fest. It'll be uh, a wonderful time. It'll so be a on. wonderful time. Well, let's take a look at the information. We've got a screen up with the information you need to know right now. Mark your calendars for October 21st through the 23rd. That will be the St. Mother Theodore Guerin Fest. If you have any questions, I've got a phone number for you. That's 812-535-2925. It's so great to see you, sister. Thank you very, very much. This has been my pleasure. We'll be right back. Stay with us.